I do not condone the use of any legal or illegal substances. This video was strictly made for education and harm reduction purposes only. I created a Patreon account for those of you who are specifically uh, wanting to contribute to this channel because you value the content that I make on a deep level. Because from my personal experience I've had so much benefits gained from psychedelics yet there is so little information on the internet on how to use them how you uh, what you can use them for and what the dangers of them are i could go into depth on it but on my patreon patreon page there's uh, like a four minute video of me explaining uh what you will give money uh, what you will donate money for what i will do with the money that you donate to me on patreon so only uh, i'm not um forcing you to do anything is just that if you want to support me and this channel and the content I make on a deeper level then uh, you could watch that video and just see if you're interested to donate because uh, what I eventually want to do with the psychedelic look on life is I want to make it my full-time job so that, I, so that I can spend almost all of my time of the week towards growing this into a very significant platform where people can go to for uh, advice about spirituality, self-development and especially about psychedelics but I, because I think that that's one of the things that this society needs. There are so many people um, whom I get comments from or DM me on Instagram and they just uh, they ask me what, what is the highest amount of a psychedelic that you've taken and I say well of magic mushrooms and truffles you know I talk a, a, a large amount of my videos are about these substances. Uh, the maximum I've ever went through on truffles and mushrooms is four and a half dried grams of magic mushrooms and 22 grams of magic of fresh magic truffles and they say what is that the, the deepest you went through on those substances you don't have to go any deeper than that it's you can use these substances which I'm not advocating to use them it's just as it, it is a possibility it's just a fact that you can gain certain benefits from them in your mental capacity that you will experience on a constant basis inside of your life and you don't have to take eight dried grams to get there actually if you are someone who has went on an eight gram dried magic mushroom trip well you you know it could have went well but that sort of experience is so comprehensive that even someone who practices spirituality for over a decade has trouble integrating that uh, in a proper way and if you are someone who just takes them because well you know you just want to take some more and more and more and go higher and higher and just break your record of how much mushrooms you can eat well then integrating such an experience will definitely interrupt with all of your beliefs that you have of the world and this will this is highly uh, risky because you might uh, create certain ideas about this world that are not actually real like certain delusional fantasies people end up in crazy asylums and they just get locked up away because of the things that they're saying but uh, lately uh, actually I might be making this video a little bit longer but now that I'm talking I just want to make it a little bit longer so uh, lately I was watching a video of um, some guy who lived on uh, on a camp here in Holland like he didn't have a house and with all sorts of people they just live in a caravan I don't uh, it, it's like a living car uh, in which you live and he was taking uh, much truffles and LSD and all sorts of these substances and going deep with them but he also drank beer and smoked lots of weed and just was intoxicating himself all the time and eventually he went to a crazy asylum because he was talking about I'm God and you're God and uh, everything is one but he didn't have the wisdom that a spiritual person has to talk about these subjects in uh, a way which makes his, his communication about what he is experiencing like himself as God to other people so these people would think that he is crazy and he's just rambling on about things that are not in the perception of other people so with with the the knowledge and the insights gained from the experiences if you don't have the wisdom to deal with those insights 
they will fuck you up, they will make you crazy, other people will think that you're crazy, you will have delusional fantasies about the world, you might even damage your own psychological and emotional system because you're taking these substances so often or something. Like, there are many ways in which this can go wrong and there's no information about it on the internet yet. They are the most powerful substances and medicines that we have on this planet. Like, uh, uh, Every day, every time when I take a psychedelic, it just amazes me that that society hasn't explored them onto a deep level as they should have been explored. But anyway, if the things that I talk about interest you very much and you want to support me on a deeper level to grow this platform to educate people on psychedelics, then please consider to donate. And if you don't want to, well, that's okay. Like, I love making these videos and... <laughs> I'll still love you very much. So thank you for watching this video. Uh, please consider to support me on Patreon. And I'll see you on your next trip.